from Waterloo. This is for your competition. <clears throat> I'm sending in my video with my painted figure, which I did quite a while ago. I don't have many historicals left, so this is the one that I'm going to put up. And he's not my best, but he's good. I figure I'll put something up for you. And congratulations on your 100th. That's quite a hallmark. But anyway, <clears throat> I don't know how well this is going to focus. But here we have a rebel non-commissioned officer. He's seen a few battles. And he's got his non-commissioned officer stripes on his shoulders. I don't know if you could see that right there. And he's got his saber. And yeah, so there he is. He's a 28 mil. He's a Dixon. I love Dixons. A lot of people complain about them having balloon heads. But uh, I don't know. Looks good to me. And there he is. He's all based and ready for action. He's got his stripes on his pants. He's about a mid-war era. 63, 64. He's a guy you'd see at Gettysburg, in fact. I didn't, <coughs> excuse me, I didn't model him on any particular regiment, but uh, the regiment that I did, I envisioned coming from Virginia, Northern Virginia, so that's his, his regiment. But there he is, so that's my competition entry. I should probably get a better camera so I can get a better close-up of this guy because I know it's not going to focus. But, uh, no, I don't think that's going to happen. But uh, there he is. I was going to enter this guy but I never fully painted him. He's basically base coated black so I never did the eyes or anything. But, uh, so there he is. That's my competition entry, Waterloo. So count me in. And there you go. Okay, buddy. Good luck. Bye-bye.